In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to create a text with a cracky material. This looks good and can be used on any object. We are gonna start by creating a new project. So from the file menu, select new and then reload startup file. This is the default scene in Blender. The default object is the cube. We don't want this cube, so delete it by pressing X and then delete. Now we are gonna add the text. So come in the create menu, come down and then select text. Now zoom in for a better view. Now we are gonna rotate the text. So press R, then X, then 90, then enter. Now we are gonna change the text. So come in the edit mode. Now change your text. I'm gonna write crack. Now come back to the object mode. Now drag out this panel and then select the object data button. Change the extrude value to 0 0.02. Change the depth value to 0 0.015 and change the resolution to 3. Now come in the modifiers tab, then select add modifier and then edge split modifier. Now go in the orthographic view using the view menu and in the front view using the view menu again. Now add a plane using the create tab. Scale the plane by pressing S, then 100, then enter. Now zoom in for a better view, move the plane just below the text. Now right click on the text to select it, then go in the materials tab, click new. Now over here change the blender render to cycles render and then press the use notes button. Change the surface type to mix shader, select the first shader as diffuse and the second shader also as diffuse. Change the color of the first diffuse shader to a grey color and the second diffuse shader to a dark grey color. In the displacement section change the displacement to magic texture. Change the depth to 0. Change the scale to 2. Change the distortion to Voronoi texture and change the intensity to cells. Change the scale to 50. Now select the plane by right clicking on it and then select new again. Now change the surface type to mix shader. Select the first shader as diffuse and the second shader as glossy. Change the roughness of glossy to 0 and change the FAC value to 0.35. Now go in the right view using the view menu and then select the lamp and change the size to 2, select the use notes button, change the strength to 1750, move the lamp just in front of the text using the green arrow and a bit down using the blue arrow, go in the front view using the view menu, press shift D to duplicate the lamp and using the X axis, move the lamp to the other side, now go to the camera view using the view menu. Now press N and then check log camera to view. Now set up your camera view. You can zoom in, pan or zoom out the view just to focus on your text. Once this is done, go in the worlds tab to change the worlds color. Now in the worlds tab, change the color of the world to black and go in the file menu to save your project. In the file select save and then save your project. I'm gonna name this project as crack.blend and then select the save blender file option. Now in the rendering section, now change the shading mode over here to rendered just to see how your image will look after rendering. Now come back to the solid mode if you're happy with the image which will be rendered. Now in the sampling section, change the number of samples to 200. The more the samples, the better is the quality of the image. Now click on the render button. This will take some time to render, so I'm gonna pause the video till it's finished. The rendering has finished and this is the final image. You will notice that the text has got distinct cracks and a bit uh, darker regions. This looks good and can be used on any object. 
and you will also notice that a few regions of this text has a bit darker color because of the magic texture which we had applied now to save this image you can go in the image menu and then select save as image now select the directory and name your image i'm going to name it crack.png and then select save as image well this concludes this video thanks for watching please subscribe and leave a comment